Okay. Looks like everything's working again. Uh, I feel somewhat better. So let's try this again in the afternoon. Everything's working. Good, 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 good. All right. Something's bothering me back here. I don't know what it is. But uh, continue. Uh, I deleted a couple saves because we had way too many. Uh, this is where I ended this morning, and this is where I ended in a couple hours ago. Um, from what I remember, I missed one thing. Uh, don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard I try, but still, the important thing is um, I do need to go pick it up and then advance the story. That is the plan. And the plan is working properly. Correct? Everything is working properly. One sec. Yep, everything's working properly. Good. Let's keep moving. So we got things to do. Yep, everybody's fully healed. I don't think I have new items in there. So first and foremost, we're gonna go to... Um... Mallory. Yeah, we gotta go back to Mallory. I missed something. You know what's bothering me? It's these glasses. Let's take those off and see how it works out. Something about my glasses today. Good thing I only need them to be far away. Kind of takes away some definition, but... Yeah, I could probably live without it for once. Not great though. Not a big fan without glasses. Alright, so we gotta go back all the way up there. Uh, I remember we beat the behemoth in the middle over there. We beat the crucible that was in there. Hold on. Alright, switch back to, to norm, to hard. I was grinding on chaos, so that's what it does. It makes the fights a bit tougher, but for the most part, it just tries to give you better gear. And I'm not worried about... Did I pass it? Nope. I'm not worried about levels. I'm worried about gear. Because um, Here, let me just show you. There's DLC in this game. I can get... Was it 10, 20, 30, and 40? I can get 40 levels whenever I want to. So if we ever hit a snag or if I ever want to push for max level which is what 200 or something like that should be easy to get I think that went pretty well or yeah we'll see we'll see what happens oh yeah I feel much better without my glasses I don't know what's going on with those things man it's hot in this room somebody probably turned on the heat because of uh it's raining outside also in the game raining not the best. Um, all these monsters are pretty much pushovers for a while. The only thing that's going to be an issue are the crucibles. Because the crucible are solo. And since Saray is pretty much the strongest character we have. The rest of the guys might not have as easy of, easy of a push going through their own little uh, crucible. Everybody gets one, by the way. Okay, let's just walk past here. What's the thing I forgot over here? It's not you. We mustn't hold back. Weak. Hang on, everyone. Better luck tomorrow. I will smite you. Not bad. Hang on, everyone. And That's the way. as much as I like, um, well, wow, that's loud. I want to become stronger as a seraph. You have more than enough talent for it. Don't push yourself too hard. As much as I like Miklio, Miklio isn't a leave it and let him play kind of bot. If I was going to play Miklio, I would play him with my own. Oops, I did that stupid too early. Oh, Reaper. Nice. Dreams. Makes the fight go easier. We won. Alright, what am I looking for over here? There's something I'm missing, and I don't understand. Hmm. Alright, I made it! Is it not here? 
What the hell? Oh, those guys. Glenwood Rabbit. Yummy bunnies. Oh, look! There's a rabbit. It's a Glenwood Rabbit. Looks so yummy. yummy. What? You got a problem? You're talking, uh, yummy cute, right? Yeah, cute and delicious. You didn't know? Rabbit flesh is a rare treat. I'm aware that they're consumed sometimes, but... You'll understand once you take a bite. Here, I'll catch this one for you and cook it up. N no, thanks. It's okay. We'll save the most scrumptious part for you. I'm fine. Seraphim don't need food. Really? If you say so. It's cool. We'll just dry it and take it along. I love bunny jerky. Ooh, I'm game. What are you doing? Run! <laughs> it ran away. Dezel, you startled the poor thing, you meanie. You're concerned for its welfare now? <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I don't know about rabbits. I've tried it back when uh, we had to do orient was it orienteering or some kind of survival field trip for ROTC. Um, we made stew out of it. It was I okay. The bottles. Tasted like chicken. The only thing that was weird was eating the eyeball. That was pretty much it. All right. Let's uh, continue on with we're going the wrong way. Continue on with the story now. We're gonna go that way to Perlot's pasture. Perlot's? Eh, one or the other. But that should be our path into Pendrago. There's a treasure chest in here somewhere. I have no idea where it is. What I'm thinking is that it might be over there where the soldiers are blocked up. That way. Who knows though. Well, I mean, getting every treasure chest isn't really that big of a deal with this game. Um, it's nice because then it can refresh and give you better items. But for the most part, I don't really care that much. The only thing I really care about is Monolith, Skits, Norman. Uh, those, are, those are the big ones. Got new items. New items. We got new enemies here. What's it look like? Big open field. Oh damn, there's a lot. Okay, well let's have a look around. Ooh, small fries. This will be quick. It's an orc farmer. This Hellion used to be. I can guess, and I'd rather not know, anyways. Thanks. Used to be a farmer. And stay down. Or an orc, one or the other. We won. As usual. Nailed it. You know what? I just realized that her umbrellas change depending on what she what weapon she's using. Very cool. Alright, let me make sure I don't miss uh, anything cool over here. No, 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 no. Okay, so we got an open area over there. Get careless. Lola, it appears we're going to get skunked. Oh, sure seem persistent. Not a fan. I wonder what it is they secrete. Is it like an oil? Man, I need a drink. Purification complete. Alright, doesn't look like there's anything against this wall. Yet. That's weird. What is that? Good to go, Rose. There was something on that bush. It was like a black line. Alright, leave Edna alone. And they keep coming too. I don't, see, I don't see why there's more showing up. Is it just because we're on hard? You sure are strange, Saray. Really? Definitely weird. You're also really not weird. What is that? Blighted wheat. A hoe? Did someone forget this here? Odd that someone would abandon a tool so central to their livelihood. Still, it's a terribly lovely field. 
Yeah. Age of chaos or not, it's nice to see that some places are still thriving. Or so it would seem. What do you mean? Take a closer look at the wheat. Huh? Oh my! Not a single berry! Same thing over here. Nothing but mold inside the husks. It's the bliss mold. The whole area is probably wiped out. The whole area? It's been going around for a while now. This year's harvest is pretty much screwed. No wonder they threw away their hoe. Lila! This is... Yes. This too must be the work of the Lord of Calamity. So this is what Age of Chaos really means. Wait, why is he getting blamed? I mean, I understand there's there's blight and then there's no um, no food, no nothing, but still, really? Uh, put Norman on there. It's just weird. All right, there we go. Oh, I see something already up there. What's this? Peach gel. I can smell herbs nearby. I'll take that. <gasps> Even out of the rain, it's still so cold. Phew! I'll say. <sighs> Ugh, damn. Ugh, they've gone from scary to annoying. Still, to think Seraphim sneeze just like we do. But the question is, are they sneezing inside the Saray? Because then it's creepy. Oop, there's one. I see you, buddy. Huh? Norman. Got any equipment? This is a uh, chain. What does chain do? Reduce string combo. Eh. Alright, just go on some amber one. There we go. I'll pick you up later. Alright, so we covered this quarter. I guess we'll go into here. We're gonna ignore there because that's where we have to go. We'll come back to it. Okay, do I go straight down there? There's a green there. I mean, somebody's block probably blocking that area. Alright, how about this? I see a chest right there. Wait, so that's... I'll just pick that up now. More importantly, we're gonna go back over here. And we're just gonna check from between this... Oh. Keep your guard up. You won't win this time. From between the patches to the green. Because mostly I want to clear the green first. Then I'll run through the, the wheat. Saray is just way too strong. You were quite strong, but we're no pushovers either. Um. Yeah, let's go clear this area. Okay, nothing over here. So let's check this. And then we'll go in there while looking around. See, saw a chest. Nothing? There's an enemies in enemies, but that's pretty much it. Alright. Okay, so where are we at? So now we got to this. So if I go south, then this clears that, and if I go north, I'll clear this. We gotta systematically break it down. Area's too big. Too big. Okay, now we clear this area now. Nothing? Guess not. I think anything with a by now if there was all right let's just hmm I can close this yeah we'll go this way all 
And then we'll go up that way and then finish the area off. Oh, boy. Boy, oh, boy. I have to catch me to catch me. But it looks like Pendrago's uh, a bit gloomy. A lot of rain. They got wheat, but no... No, uh, what do you call it? Yield? I think yield's the word for it. Doesn't look like there's anything over here. Talk to this guy. Let's see what he's, uh, he's probably gonna shoo me away. Nope, looks like a rock slide. What was that? I heard something. Looks like the torrential rain caused the landslide. They're in the middle of making repairs. Uh, come on. Alright, fine. Oh, that's who I heard. That was unexpected. Not something I'm interested in. My instincts tell me that there's treasures nearby. Is it that one the way over there? Saray, so look around you. Okay. I'll oh wait, no, there's one up there. Okay, they marked it on the map. How do I get to it? I don't. Good. Thanks, Saray. Tell me about it later. I gotta at least do some fights to get equipment. How do I get to the point where Rose is the strongest character we got? I still think just because she has two weapons makes her stronger. Alright, was there anything behind the fence? I don't think so. I think Saray would have picked up on it by now. And we did. Oh, hey. It's one of those giant things over there. Is that a treasure chest? Yes, it is. Take that. Alright. I still haven't cleared this big area here, but if I go all the way around, it should be fine. Weapons ready! Let's see deal with that. Raging time! I slipped in the inn, right? Because in this game, after you've fought a certain, num certain number of battles, you get tired. And you have to go back to the inn to rest, or you have to eat snacks. Otherwise, you don't start with uh, the blue bar down there. It starts lower and lower. To a certain point, maybe it goes down to zero. And then you have to defend the first couple seconds every fight. I think that's how it works. From experience. Because I like to grind mindlessly. Um, let's see. Nothing here. Not even in the corners? Okay, fine. Nope. No thank you. Looking for Norman. Uh, the other ones and the other ones. Yeah, I can go this way. Birdies. Where's the chest? What is that? This aroma. Excuse me? What is this? It's a rock. Good. Good to know. I'm glad that I don't know the difference of it between all of them. I mean, it looks like something else. Or maybe not. Maybe it's just because I don't have my glasses. We'll blame it on that. I thought it was like a, a teleporter. A warp point on your feet. Oh, leave me alone. You no, know, fine. Let's fight. Oh, uh, um, uh, sir. There we go. You, Better luck tomorrow. Let's get them before they fly away. That goose flew the chicken coop. That doesn't quite make sense. Oh, what was that slowdown? Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. You're not no done yet. Can stand in our way. <laughs> <laughs> there was definitely some slowdown, and I don't know why. And sometimes I ask myself, uh, you know what? No. Enough lyrics. Too many lyrics. Where's the sleep? Ooh, hey. 
This is a bad zone. Wait, if I talk to him, he might have good items. I'll be back. It's a, it's, it's a long walk. First of all, if I'm this affected by it, why isn't he? Is it like the power of selling things? Talk to me. Talk to me. Please talk to me. Yes. Yes. 20,000. Jeez. Is it that good? It's okay. Buy this. Ooh, I'll buy that one. Uh, guess. You know, I won't. I won't see this guy in a while, so I might as well just buy everything. Ooh, do I want this? It's ten thousand. That thing's expensive. This thing's twenty up here. Hmm. That would cut. Oh, this would cut a lot of my money too. You know, I don't need that many of these. Um, no. Definitely not. Oh, I don't have one, so I'll take that. Nah. No. Wait, I don't have these. All the stuff I don't have, that's what I'll keep. That one's nice. Keep that one. Um, no. I don't need that. There's a lot of stuff I don't have. I'm not going to buy this one. It's too expensive. Now, well, to a certain point, I don't need that one either. Okay. Let's get- let's just buy a bunch of things and, uh, be broke for a bit. Yeah, it's not that. Okay, let's go. Let's walk our asses back. To be fair, we should be faster now. We're 40,000 less. Should be a lot. A lot, a lot. Unless I just use the credit card on it. I should be a lot lighter. Am I out yet? Nice. I'm gonna make all 40,000 back using you. Let's make it quick. 40,000, let's go. Evil be gone! I got you! I'm not gonna make 40,000 off of this guy, am I? Nice heal. Well, that was actually pretty decent. Must have been. If you were complimenting me. I'm about 39,000 and a half left and a half what math am i using are there any herbs around here of course there's herbs around here this one right here i'm gonna sneak it from that guy didn't even notice all right this is a dead end so there has to be something here there might be something nearby yeah it's at the bottom of this no there it is can't get it anyway it's gold All right, where are we at? I still haven't checked. I think I did check this area. And then I haven't checked that middle area and that top area. Let's go. All right, so we can't go that way because that way is heavy infected. Heavy malevolence. Is it this one? Yeah, straight ahead. Oh, there's cows. I want the cows. What is that? Oh, it might be a strong boy. Hold on. Quick save. Quick save twice. This one's a strong one, isn't it? Yeah. He looks different and he's passive. Don't underestimate Danger Roma. Oh. Danger Roma. Sounds dangerous. We'll have Saray cut through the situation. I mean, since arts aren't all that effective. So we can win this if we use sword based physical attacks, right? Yep. That's why I said cut through. Get it? You just wanted a reason to say that. Well, we should be okay then, right? Radiant Shadow Shock! Raging Winds! 
Oh, knocked him away. Oh, he got some iframes. He got away. Follow him. Damn, we're actually doing pretty well. Be sure to let me know if there's treasure nearby. 72? Jeez. Powerful enemy using no items. Got it. Oh, it was it was one of the special ones. They got anomalous orb from it. Hmm. Hmm, what? Oh, the cows. I can't imagine this not being a point of interest. It's a cow. Highland steer. A Highland steer? Excuse me while I salivate. Notice the graceful line from the neck to the sirloin. An A5 ring specimen. Um, it looks nice and all, but it's a cow. It's a cow, said the poor country bumpkin who'd never tasted the majesty of a real Highland steak. We're talking melts in your mouth. It's that good. And how can it be a Highland steer? This is Roland's. Is that really all you can think about? <laughs> Presumably they're so called because they originally came from Highland. But we didn't see any when we were there. Raising large herds of them as actual livestock requires vast amounts of grazing land. Roland's geography is probably more suited to that kind of thing. I see. I guess that makes sense. Of course. If the world doesn't get off its current path, all the cattle will die off, and it'll be a moot point. That's also true. Ahem! <clears throat> also, Drago stew is made with Highland beef. It's considered an auspicious dish due to the symbolism of eating Highland itself. Uh, okay? Yeah. Mundane trivia. A sea rank specimen. Sheesh, forgive a girl for trying to lighten the mood. Okay, got our skit. What's left? We got this area left, this area, and then this. Okay. We got the boss out of the way, so... Boss for me. Seems like we're at the point where we can take on the bosses for the most part. Uh, we'll ignore those, those areas. Let's see. Yeah, I'll stick to the top. I'm gonna go top side first, and then we're, we'll go to that thing over there. That one's for Miklio. The hell? Oh. Save point! Save me! Don't let him catch me! Actually, he is gaining, isn't he? Nope, you stay away. You stay away. You're gonna fade. Ha ha! Oh, he got me. Don't get careless! Better luck tomorrow. Time to Go rock on. out. He still got me. How's this? Yeah. Hang on, everyone! Getting heavy. I don't like that rose plants that mine thing. <laughs> it's funny hey, though. Hey. Circle. Try this on. Purification complete. I guess if you really want to defend your seraph, you could just drop that in there. All right, let's find out what this area is. Oh, can't go this way either. Great Camelot Bridge. Going back. Well, it seems like. That's more of an invisible wall than any than plot. It's just like you can't go here right now, you're not strong enough. Stupid is as stupid does, they say. Yeah, the 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 dreams. Dreams. Yeah. Hey, hey. Not yet. Better luck tomorrow. Let's get him! Once you deal Dream with that. Next. Idiot. White peak! White peak! I should get more equipment with stun chance. How are Saray's capabilities as a shepherd? Well, I think he's quite talented. Yeah, if I get stun chance, maybe um, my damage output would go higher. I see that. There must Take be that. herbs around here. Because for the most part, I've only been collecting the uh, attack ups. But you do massive amount of damage if you get stuns, nearby. so maybe I'll just stick to stuns. See a save point over there. I guess we'll take this on and hope for the best. It's a monolith. Alright, let's do it. 
put some equipment on before we do anything. Hmm. No, I need plus attack. Yeah, sure, I'll take that. Actually, you got any defense defense ups? Take those. 95? Sure. 390, no 400s. I'll take a 390. 397? Sure. There you go. Two sixty four twenty seven. Yeah, I'll take the four twenty. Hmm, that one five eighty. Yeah, sure. All right, we should be good with that. Hope for the best. Only Mikleo may enter. All right, Mikleo. You're level 50. Don't mess this up. Time for battle. Water. Shrek, oh, he's casting. Right this is issue. Take that. Hey, Leo, stop casting. Attack. Serpent of water. Open the way. This is bad. <laughs> Lunar stream. There you go. Just do that. Hey, Cleo, please. Finish them off first. Twin flow. Make Leo no. There you go. Stick to that. Make Leo, you have spear arts. There you go. Spear arts. Ice. Or staff arts. Mikleo, please. Uh. Don't make me take control, Mikleo. Mikleo. Uh. That doesn't work, Mikleo. Uh. Well, at least he's killing them. Oh, he's got this. He's got this. Don't cast. Come forth, okay, of well. Water. You're asking for it. Uh, Stop forth, casting. Make Leo, please. You're so lucky. Of ice. Ice Return to point. Uh. Make Leo. Don't do Come this. Forth, of water. Or at least cast something uh. faster. No, oh, that's that's a tough fight. Oh no, he's gonna die here. These pixies aren't forgiving. You have you have to knock him out, Mikleo. Mikleo, you can't cast. Mikleo, no. There you go. You got this, buddy. Knock him out. Oh no, Mikleo. You're, you're making this harder than it needs to be. There you go. Come on. Almost there. Knock him out. Oh, he got paralyzed. Even worse. Make Leo, no. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Now, try this. How do you heal? Just, uh, I don't want to use an item. There you go. Hey, actually, can I put them back on now? He might be okay now. Cause they're just casting anyway. Return to boy. Right? You know nothing. Come there you go. Water. Good job, Mikleo. 
Aqua Serpent. Oh, that trade was not good. Go heal. Make Leo go heal. Burning red, freezing blue, hail in tandem. Make Leo, please. Return to boy. Okay. All right. Fine, Make Leo. Fine. Why you gotta be like this, dude? Nope. Okay, that was my fault too. Rise, miss. Now. Take that. Ow. Worthless. Okay, one down. Go. No escape. Worthless. Go. Go. No escape. This is bad. How do I switch? Oh. Why do you walk so slow, McLeo? Kill him first, kill him first. Uh, may your knowledge seep from you. There you go. Mind player. How do you not? Uh, At least he's dead. Oh no, there's more. Oh, we got two. All right, seriously. Ice Reaver, the power of water. Azure and Crimson. Okay, don't do that one. Return to boy. At least that one's faster. You know nothing. Serpent How can I not hit this thing? Open the way. Thank you. Well, a win is a win. I I guess. I wouldn't call that a win. We got hurt by that one. That was not pretty. Good job, Mikleo. Well, it wasn't too bad. No surprises. Exactly. No need for me to enter the ring. My manservant Mebo was enough to handle the problem. I work my butt off and that's the thanks I get? Oh, was it hard? It was hard, wasn't it? Sorry we asked too much of poor, feeble Mebo. Feebo. <laughs> Fear not, dearly departed Feebo. Edna shall avenge you. Oh my gosh, you have a comeback for everything. For everything. Stop that! He's gotta know he's being played with. Why does he put up with it? He puts up with all sorts of things. He's just that kind of guy. Huh. I can see that. Mikleo, you did it. No, I didn't! Wait, I mean... Huh? <laughs> huh? Yeah, you did. Good job, buddy. Let's put that new thing that you just got. Noble Quantum. Sure, why not? You can have it. Was there like an item here somewhere? Maybe not. Alright, now we just have to go down. Go there, go all the way to here, and then clear this area. And we're done. And that only took like half an hour. 
Jesus. I feel better without my glasses, so that's important. I can't wait to play Dead by Daylight later. New killer. I think this is an optional dungeon. We're gonna come back to it. I wanna go through this area. I think there's a chest here somewhere. Was it right down the middle? There it is. There's one. It seems there's a treasure chest near us. Yes, sir. Nope. You Opens from the other me. side. <laughs> Great. Now, now I'm in like manual. Together. Ready? Prepare yourself! Jade Luminescence! This is it! Like chill out, Rick Sargo! Freezing strike! Hold on! Let's get him! Just chill out, Kay. Let's get him! Everyone okay? Everybody's okay. Can't open this. There we go. Shiba Inu. Alright, let's keep looking. There's a lot of fields here. Out here in the fields. Oh, fight these. Dangerous I'll encounter? I'll take it. Folk, let's get him! My dad! Hang on, everyone! Catch him, please! Fear this! Hang on, everyone! Let's go air! Don't let up! Because he's a shining mirror! Don't let up! Don't let There's gotta be a lot of Hellions in the world. For me to just fight a bunch of them. Because they always come in like a party of five or so. Knife handling. Do you have anything? I'm not hiding anything, I swear. That was pretty fast. Fast answer is a yes. Means there's something else. Okay. Is this the end of this area? Yep. Okay, now let's walk between the fields. After that, we walk to the other end of that field. Damn it! Let's go. Ooh, small fries. This will be quick. Focus. My divine flame. Go under. Let's go, my children. Sword flare. Crimson edge. Shatter bag. Hang on, everyone. Don't let up. Let's surround me. Quick bomb. Hang on, everyone. Wonderful. Nope. Down on your knees. Here goes. Gotcha. Not yet. Wow, that trap actually worked. Oh, Edna, no! Sweet! Shield me! Think you're Edna, heal yourself! Oh, I cancelled the spell that she had. I got you! Be gone! Let us not be full of ourselves and continue. She had her spell queued up and everything. Any anything? Oh, mango. Hmm? Hmm? What? Oh, hey! Just looking for you. This is Phantom. Okay. That's fine. Put you on this one. Let's go, Phantom. He's a Phantom. Let's see. This area is done. Oh, there's, there's one right there. That smell! Is it herbs? Yeah, you know, you know herbs by their smell. You got a problem. There's a chest over there. Ah, oh, th this area is just too big. Just the fact that I spent this much time just clearing this map. Way too much. Take that chest right there. What's this? All right, what's left? Just this bottom area here, and then we go to the one up top there. So pr pretty much we're done. We're pretty pretty much done. 
Okay, did I have to go this way? No, I didn't. So I'll look. I guess if I win step, it would have been faster. Okay, we're done here. Let's go that way. Enemies. Nothing of, nothing of note to look for. Okay, we're done. In we go over there. We got our monolith. We got Mikleo's victory. The Highland steer. Yeah, we're good. Let's go in here. This is an optional Me, dungeon. That's that we can't really fully beat yet, but there's just My stuff here that we can pick up. Treasures nearby. Good. But how do I get to it? Oh, I gotta go around, huh? Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay, let's go have a look. Um. What does it look like? Oh, let's start with the other one. Serene, also, look around you. I guess there's a Norman around here because she popped for it once we were downstairs. You're there, aren't you? Oh, there's one in the middle. Okay, I got you. That's why. That's why I got popped. Well, we can't get to that yet. Maybe. Any enemies here? These guys? Just you guys? All right, let's do it. You awake, Edna? I wonder how strong they are. An aged trend. Like it sounds, it's quite old. I'm getting old just listening to your explanation. Is it called a trend? That was a tree on. Wait, what's it called? Be gone, Crimson Edge. It's time. Howling Blade, full tempest. All right. Ooh, nice save. It's not often you see a seraph using a staff like a club. I mastered it while practicing with Saray. It's got the reach you'd need to win, since he's taller. That's not the reason why. But the height. That's not it. <laughs> Best friends. Definitely not it. Also, is that a this treasure is, chest? This is how you use that. Uh, anything here? Glacial earrings. Saray, look carefully at the ground. There's more this way. Let's see if there's another enemy here. Can we pop another enemy? Nope. Okay. You know, I'm just a little disappointed, but Carry I guess that's fine. You, oh, Not this camera sucks. You're all so strong. Uh, I think it's you that's strong. Am I going the right way still? Yeah. Uh. Well, I didn't check that area. Well, I guess if there was something there, it would pop, wouldn't it? Yeah, I might as well go check. It's not like I'm pressed for time anyway. Okay, I am pressed for time. Let's go. Yeah. Oop, wrong way. Looks like there's no but no enemies on the ceiling. Big plus for me because I keep getting jumped by those things. Has to be an enemy here, right? Yep, of course there is. Counting on you, Lila. Better look tomorrow. Inflict physical ailments for effect on the undead. Got it? They certainly get intense when attacked. Maybe we should save them for last then. Ready? Prepare yourself! Jade Luminescence! This is it! Are they healing? Let us not be full of ourselves and they were healing. This way. 
Oh, there's something here. Can't do anything about it, though. Oh, shoot. There was we another one on the other back. side. I should have fought them both. Everyone okay? That was a clean fight. It just grouped everyone up. Hmm. Oh. I'm gonna do this one first. Then I'm gonna fight this guy. Ready, everyone? Let's see a deal with that. <gasps> Idiot. Okay, that's not nice. Be sure wonder... to let me know if there's treasure nearby. Got it? I wonder how the wrist works like that. If you have a weapon as light as a dagger, it won't slice through, we know that. Okay, let's just do this. So would you intentionally flick away so you don't like break your wrist trying to get in there? A bit too much for Rose. I wonder who wound up in this coffin. The decorative work suggests a privileged background. Nobility, perhaps, or a clan chief. Very much so. This is, um, quality rock. So where would you date it? pre rollance times? Hard to say. It wouldn't surprise me if it were actually related to the founding family of the Rollins Empire. Hmm. From the texture, I'd say it was constructed in the storied, cold and smooth style. Sad that it's been looted. We should take care that our own studies are more respectful to the departed. <coughs> dust everywhere. This is further corroboration of the poorly cleaned hypothesis. Um, Rose? What are you doing? Oh, I was just trying to contribute to your little academic geek out, but... Sorry, I'm way out of my league. Yeah. Don't, uh, try too hard. <laughs> yeah, think I won't. Aw, bless her. Bless her for trying. Good job, Rose. Didn't work out, but good job. Let's see. I can go up. You know, yeah, let's go up first. Didn't scare me. Missed it though. Saray, I'm Think coming. Coming. Evil be gone. Down on your knees. We think dragon. Go get him. Time to rock How are you not weak to fire? Come on. So are you weak to water? Are they like petrified? You sure are strange, Saray. Really? Definitely weird. You're okay. also really moving on. Let's go up here. I think the other side brings you all the way around. Maybe. At least it opens this side up for me. What's up, guys? Stupid is as stupid does, they say. Beast, thunder! Time for your embrace. Evil be gone! Here go! Finally. Bye! Five Weak. stars! Hey, hey. Here. Shining mirror! Now my Here go! This time. Banquet of flames! Concerto in furnace! There's still more! Want to see a deal with that? Rising Phoenix! What? Idiot. Time for your embrace. Next. I We're not done evil. yet. Finally. Crimson Bridge! Yes, not yet! Either. Dance, Embers! Lucky Strike! This is it! Better luck tomorrow. Bridget wins! Shiny it's not often you see a Seraph using a staff like a club. <laughs> I'm... Definitely not because of his height. Uh, which way did we come from? Let's go to this one. There What's might it? be something nearby. Get ready! Whoa, Leave that was weird. At a certain point, I fear that we're over leveled. But then again, this, these are just mobs, so we should be able to over level them. Everyone okay? But the the bosses, those ones are a bit weird. Gold boots, life bottle. I don't think we should be able to beat those guys up that easily. But we are. So I don't know how to feel about it. It's over here. 
No enemies up top. Just you guys. Is that an herb? Oh, it's on the other side. Weapons ready! Are you ready? Down on I will your smite evil! Not yet! See you next month, loser. Hang on, everyone! Opponent. Go back to sleep. Double Fire team and don't let up! Time to rock Tinder out! Top. You think you're tough? You were quite strong. But we're no pushovers, either. I'm sure they'd be tougher. Wait, hold on. Where are we? We can't get to that side yet. How do we... Oh, yeah. Yeah, can't get there yet. That's later. Later when we actually get more powers. I know there's a chest behind I sense this. Nearby. Two. Dark bottle. Void slasher. I can use that dark bottle later when I'm, uh, when I'm grinding. Oof. Now we finish up with this area and, uh, we done. We go to the city and, uh, cover that area. It seems there's a treasure chest near us. So I'm pretty sure Sergei's waiting for us over there. Focus, guys! You won't win this time. Can't let Sergei down. He seems like a nice guy. He even believes in the shepherd. Even though we kicked his troops' ass. This is it. Once you deal with that. Sweet dreams. Double demon Idiot. This goes next. Shadow shot. You know, you're pretty mature, Rose. Coming from you, I'm not sure how to take that. What now, Edna? And, and you're, you're such, such a kid. kid. <laughs> they got a they got a nice little rivalry going on. But I feel like Rose can handle Edna more than Alicia could. So Alicia was just being toyed with. Am I going the right way? Yep. Hello. Wait, what? Counting on you, Lila. Thunder Thunder and rain. Rain. How did I pass them? You did know this would happen. Oh, hey, what is this? Fire? Oh, yep. Yeah. What's this? Because I can't open the other one because the other one was yellow. And the yellow one is for Edna's power, which we can't get yet. So we'll just have to come back to that one. Oh, is there two? If there's two, I'll stop. Ah, oh, damn it! Ready, Are you ready? Hey, hey. Well, oh, technically I was right. If there was two, I was gonna stop. I stopped. Well, that was quick. All right. Up we go, and I think we're done with this area now. A Norman? Yep, that we can't reach yet, of course. Wait, that's... Yep, still can't reach that one either. Alright, let's head to uh, the, the good parts. Wait, where is it? Is it that way, right? Oh, man. I need a drink. <coughs> what happened? I don't know. You're the one cooking. I think you'll I think you'll be all right as long as you don't cook or bake. Also, let's we can change these now. Once we're in the city, I don't really need these. But the open world sucks. Especially big open areas like the, the last two we've been in. Yeah, I'll eat these. 
Hmm. Yeah. There you go. Let's just eat. Sounds like a tasty place. Alright, guys. I'm not gonna eat your food in here. I already ate. Give me this. And save real quick. That one. Ooh, let's go in. Wow, this place is huge. Yes, Pendrago is the largest city on the Glenwood continent. Damn. Hmm. Wait, where can we find an inn? I recommend the one directly in front of the plaza. You sure know your way around. Well, you know, I used to come here a lot. Wasn't this place like in the Earth and Historia? The Iris Gem? Well, don't you look unique. Let me guess. You're from out of town. You run away from a circus or something? Eh, just keep your nose out of trouble. And I don't give a flip. Listen, you should get yourselves out of this rain and find somewhere to board for the night. I know an inn. To get there, just go up the stairs on your right when you see the fountain. Okay. Understood. So let's go see the fountain. Oh, there's something going on over there. See the star? Mm hmm. How's this for a start? That looks like Sergey, actually. Well, we're not gonna deal with that. Let's start with this. Fountain in the square. What a resplendent fountain! Yeah, it's one of the famous sites of Pendrago. I don't know a lot about it, but supposedly, the water's piped in from afar through an underground channel. Oh, I see. So much work for something that doesn't even serve any purpose. Stupid, simple humans. Well, considering their lack of seraphic arts, I think their technological advancement is commendable. Useless, pointless, waste of effort. It's also known as the Fountain of Wrath. Wrath? Why do they call it that? Something with the piping's all messed up. Every now and then. <gasps> like that. Oh dear. <laughs> stupid, stupid humans. Oh. Every now and then it squirts out water. Got you. Alright. Looks like there's a Norman behind that fountain. Hello, sir. What do you see? You see anything good? Look at your reflection. Justice. What does justice do? Uh, nothing all that interesting. There you go. I'll pick you up later. Speaking of which, I do need a Lord of the Land. Now that you mention it, I could use one. Alright. I guess we go up. Don't trigger it. Don't trigger it. Ah, damn it. Oh. A lizard man. Whoa. Sergey. He's one of the cardinal's subordinates. I tried to apprehend him, but oh, you saw what he was like. His movements were incredible. You could tell, right? It was a hellion. The Cardinal's underling is a Hellion? Then... Forgive me, sir. He's escaped into the Shrine Church. It looks like it's true. I believe he was likely a messenger of... Duh! I'm cold. You can blather on inside. Tell us the details after we find shelter from the rain, if you please. Our friends are feeling a bit chilly, and even a seraph can catch a cold. Friends? Aww. Not that you could tell, since you can't see them. F forgive me. I should have been mindful of the seraphim's presence. Let us head for the night tower. Your wife sure is considerate. Yep. 
He still thinks they're married. <sighs> Don't be jealous. All right. Oh, hey. Take that. Check the inn. Check the shop. What about you? Are you another brother? The strongest weapons around here are made of mithril. No doubt about it. They say you can't get mithril any anymore. But, um, and my dad was the only one who knew how to manipulate it. We each inherited one of the necessary techniques, but we're all so hard-headed. Uh, that's the thing, man. If you're interested in making mithril weapons, your first task is to get chummy with all my brothers. Got it? Got it. Oh, you and I? We're family, bro. Come on. Uh, take the ones I don't own. Okay. Buy the one that's on sale. Okay, let's go see if any of them are good. Don't care. Definitely don't care. I'll buy that one. Hmm. Hey. Nope. Ooh, this one's gonna be nice later. Uh, nope. Stun damage rate? Yeah. Get the next one. What is this one? Water type reduced. Oh, nope. I mean, it's nice. Take Wait, no, don't, don't take the zero ones. Invalda? I'll take that one. Involved is always nice. Whoa, what just happened? What just happened? One sec. Hmm, that's weird. That's super weird. Okay. Alright, well, I'll stick to, the, to buying just that. We're already buds, so I don't need to buy that many from you. Do I go to the east quarter? Hmm. Let's try. That puts me in... Is, that, is this where I need to go? Let's just go to the inn first. Go watch some... Uh, some skits. That's really weird. What just happened there? To the inn! There's people here. The original shrine church was erected in the golden days of the era of Asgard. It was only later that the, that the cathedral hall was added to it. Past the cathedral, the ancient shrine is preserved almost exactly as it was in the days of yore, although only the priests are allowed entry. This weather's doing a number on my sales. Might be time to consider a career change. Yeah, I've been thinking of that since uh, Corona. You're a softy, aren't? After all, aren't you, Rose? Hm? Nah, I was getting cold out there myself. Not you. Uh, which building is the Knight's Tower? Doesn't really stick out that much, but the Knights have their tower over in the southeastern corner of the city. They usually got a Knight standing guard outside it, so it should be easy to spot once you get there. I guess I can't go wrong with buying the map. Ask yourself this, Ray. How many adventures, adventurers go without a good map in their pocket? That's right, none. They all got lost and died. Don't be them. Uh, where were we supposed to find those caverns? Well, caverns means caves, right? Around here, I'd say the most likely spot would be somewhere south of the Meadows of Chime. The area the knights were blocking off looks particularly promising. What do you say we come back to this a little later? Oh, that was the one to look for the underground cave. We can't just leave those crucibles as they are. Hmm, we could just blow the whole ruins to smithereens. Whoa, easy there. Just joking, joking. That we have the power to do that anyway. No, I think our only hope of it for extinguishing the malevolence, uh, the malevolence there is to defeat the Hellions. It won't be easy. Uh, they're scattered all over the continent. Alright, let me out. Oh, come on. 
No skits there? What about in the back room? You guys have things in here that I can steal? It's really all I can ask for, right? Nope, I got nothing. Okay, fine. Let's go read some let's go get some skits. What do you have for sale? Eh, steak it is. I remember hearing some old folk tale about a seraph and a hellion. Really? What kind of story was it? Well, it's like this. There was this kind old man and this mean old lady, right? And the old lady cuts the tongue of the little bird they were keeping. How cruel. When the old man goes to the cabana that his bird flew away to, the bird brings him a treasure chest. But when the old lady goes to that cabana, she gets a treasure chest full of awful things. Wait, hold on. Can you even cut off a bird's tongue? And what's up with the bird and the treasure chest? How could a bird prepare something like that? Plus, the bird's cabana? Pretty sure you mean nest. That's not the point of the story, okay? Jeez. Another skit? Nope, not another skit. Keep going. Need a bit more. Actually, I don't know if I've seen these skits. Maybe that's why. Pretty sure I haven't. Keep going. I want these skits. I think I already got them. Damn it. There's no checklist to, to see if I got them or not. That's the only issue here. Actually, there's a checklist for this one. There. Not that one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, hey. Am I short? I think I'm short one. I think I did actually. All right, well, I'm just gonna move on for that. I'll just get it later. I'm gonna do it one more time for good faith. Okay, we're done. I just want my skits. But these are all um, skill skits, so they're not actually all that important. We'll just have to deal with it later. Alright, let's go... I want to try going this way. Let's see what they got. You'd think there'd be an item over here. But there's not. Hmm. Hmm. It's not bad. Okay, so that one goes to the castle. Where does this area go? The atmosphere in town feels kind of stagnant. Must be all of this rain we're having. It's been so long, I'm beginning to, <laughs> I'm beginning to forget what the sun looks like. It's like an orange ball in the sky. Hey, hey! Who are you? G uh, Gazer. I said geyser. Alright, what you got? Uh, something I don't need again. There you go. I'm sure I'll find a use for you later. But for now, don't really need you. Take that. Keep looking. Hey, another one. Panacea. Panacea later. Wonder if there's like a, a breaking and entering segment in here. I don't see why not. You're close to the thing. Alright, what's the. You guys got something to say? Not a trace left, huh? Damn. I just know the church is behind it. If only we had proof. The knights are behind Sergei on this. I thought the. 
A couple of the knights would be more sympathetic to the church, but I guess not. Okay. Talk about armonization. Keep moving. Got places to be, people to see. Is this door closed? Who does this go to? Don't oh, know. Let's go to the one that heads to the castle. Maybe that's a better one. So we're here. There's the eastern. There's the knight's tower. Okay. Um, where does this go? Oh, this goes to the actual place that we can't go to, right? Yeah, I think this is the cathedral right here. It looks like the malevolence is seeping out of it. So this is the shrine church. Can't charge in right now. Okay. I wonder what the one in the middle is. That's probably the castle then. Or, oh, not that way. Or it's, um, amphitheater? Amphitheater. Nailed it. I mean, it's a theater of sorts. Anything back here? Yep, there was. Can't pick it up though. Gonna have to wait on that one. Okay. So the next area is the Knight's Tower and the Eastern Quarter. Of course, we're not going to go to the Knight's Tower yet. Chest over there, though. Come back to it. Let's go this way first. Go fully explore the town. I still got about, what, like an hour left? That's fine. You know how nobody's made inroads to the Waylish Ruins in Ifried's Hunting Ground yet? Right? What? You just gave me two names. Two places. Well, with all this hardship, I'm starting to think there's fortunes to be found there. Huge fortunes. Huge fortunes. Well, I mean, if Ifrid's name is in it. Ifrid in pretty much every Tales game, legendary pirate. So, Ifrid is pretty much synonymous to treasure. Oh, hey, turtles. I just followed the recipe. Should be fine. Yeah, but I found a turtle. First we lose the Emperor, and now the Pope disappears. I have no idea about how things will turn out now. Now with the Cardinal holding the reins of the country. If there are mir miracles going on like everyone says, then I wish one would come along and fix this incessant reign and unwanted war. Wait, it's unwanted? Ah, oh, so it's all the Cardinal, or the Knights, whoever's in power. So we can stop the war just by it hold on it's never that simple first of all but we could delay the war if we take out uh the cardinal but if we take out the cardinal then it might also escalate the war and then screw us all over he betrayed he betrayed us turtles it can't be forgivens he better be waiting with his head ups in his shell oh yeah I made the new maps. Yep. Thanks for the business. Now I'll continue on my journeys. You got it, buddy. He's the lowlife who backstabbed the whole Turtles clan. We, we's never gonna forgive him. I was gonna keep my head poking out of my shells and wait till he comes along. Also really weird. Okay. Looks like there's a pocket over here. And no item. Lots of pockets, but no items. This poor city. What about you? I heard the shepherd showed up in the battle a while back. 
In Lastenbell, near where it all happened, there's more talk about that than there is about the Cardinal's miracles. Oh, we're gaining traction over there. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing though, because these people might think that we're public enemy. Hmm, that's fine. They tried to protect those gaffarous ruins up in the north past the wheat fields by placing them under imperial protection. But the looting just kept on going regardless. It's this rain you see. It's driving folks who don't have money to do desperate things. I, I suppose so. It's been a year already since this darned rain began. So right when the Pope disappeared. This might be the biggest city in the land, but that's... Well, that's a fat lot of good when it, all the crops are ruined. That's fair. Without sunlight, those things are probably going to die. Compared to Highland, most of Roland's is under, undernourished. The capital isn't so bad, but in the countryside, it's not rare to find people starving. Which would gather a, a lot of, um, what do you call it, war support. Because if they had a war, they can take whatever Highland has. Because in their mind, Highland is rich. So, yeah, they could absolutely do that. Nothing scarier than people with nothing to lose. Apparently, there are still lots of ruins out there with undiscovered rare treasures just waiting to be found. Even those ruins they say are under Imperial protection have hardly any patrols right now. I bet you could walk up to, let's just say, the Ganglin Ruins over in Western Vault Gorge and waltz right in. None the wiser. Of course, to be fair, just making the trek all the way out there is no minor undertaking. I guess I can't fault the Empire for cutting costs where they can. Okay, fine. Eh, it's not too bad. Also, we picked up a Norman, right? Let's see if we can uh, sleep that off and pick up what I want. The only other skit, the the two skits that I'm looking for is one for finding Norman, and the other one for windstepping for Miklio. But uh, I think I might have gotten both of those already, which is a bit of an issue. But that's what happens when you're uh, when you're new game plus. Sometimes not everything lines up. All right, let's go. Let's go uh, talk to Sergei at the Knight's Tower. We got a few more things to do. Should be under an hour. Okay, let's see here. So I gotta go over there to talk. I'll just go talk to this guy first. Those without permission cannot enter the castle. This damn weather. You should hurry home and get yourself dry before you catch a cold. Seriously though, there should be a lot more people sick in this area. Okay. What about you, Rose? You good? Okay, we're good. Let's go in. This should be a better place to talk. Did everything go okay? Can we get in the church? I secured the permissions, but after that last incident, I'm afraid we're likely under high scrutiny. So what else is new? They weren't big fans of us in the first place. Yeah, good point. We've got nothing to hide. Let's do it. Look at that. Ever since Rose joined up with us, I feel like Saray has become so much more proactive. Too bad it means that much more trouble for us. Thank you. It was my decision to begin with. And besides, I've really wanted to see the shrine inside the church. There's something about you that reminds me of the Pope. He too would never hesitate to spare expenses for the sake of his people. Oh boy, another masochist. I see. I've prepared lodgings for you. I pray that the Seraphim will also be able to rest well tonight. 
But Captain, it's been three days since last we heard from Boris after his infiltration. I believe we should hurry. Who's Boris? The rain may be affecting our food supplies, but I shall prepare our famous Drago stew for you. Aren't you the least bit concerned? He's your only brother. I do not wish to burden you with my troubles any more than I already have. Please rest for now. It's a kind offer. Let's take it. We will. Thank you. Yeah, but I kind of want to save his brother. Alright, where do we go here? Head to the inn. Well, I want to talk to these folks first. The duty to advise the young emperor should not fall to a single party, be it the night squad, the church, or any other body. It is times like this, like these, that the Pope Macedra would know what to do. Okay, Pope Macedra. If anything, Captain Sergei is overly earnest, but that's why we all stick with him. Many of our ranks went missing in their investigation of the Cardinal. All of them were con competent knights. One starts to wonder. Boris is Sergei's younger twin. He's always doing his utmost to support his older brother. And even more reason to save him. Please refrain from entering here. You know, Shepard, not all members of the Night Squad feel the same as the Captain. You'd do well to remember that. Ooh. He does not like me. Boris is the captain's younger brother. He's always supported his older brother. In both the public and private spheres. He was a talented knight like his brother. But he left to aid the search for the cardinal. And now? There are lots of lots of others like him who have been who have gone missing too. <sighs> I do not wish to burden you with my troubles any more than I already have. Please. Just rest now. Okay, but I want to talk about this guy. He looks familiar. Hey, isn't this the guy from the Earth and Historia? The first captain of the Platinum Knights, General Georg Heldolf. Heldolf! And this was painted over 20 years ago. He would definitely show up in the Earth and Historia. So this is Heldolf. Oh, that was it? I thought it was going to be a longer skit. Alright, let's go back then. Man, this coconut water Sergei is a bit different. Sergei sure seems like a good guy. He is. Though I fear he may be a bit too genuine and sincere to command the knights. I agree. I hope he has what it takes. We've got plenty of worries of our own. Let's not get hung up on other people's issues. Okay. I mean, Sergei is a nice guy. I really do want to help save his, uh, save his brother. But how long and even if he's going to let us interfere. Now that was a meal. Uh. Rose. Okay. Learn some manners. You sure can eat. So can these two. It was surprisingly good. I couldn't help myself. Drago stew, 85 points. 85? My policy is eat while you can. It's been ingrained in me since I was a kid. That's the law of a soldier. Hmm. A soldier, huh? Soldier? Aren't you and your buddies in an assassin's guild? Well, you know, it wasn't always like this. 
We used to be just a band of mercenaries. Not to brag, but they called us the best on the continent. Is that right? <sighs> That's it for me. We've got a job to do tomorrow. Is Rose's band of mercenaries the one you mentioned before? Was it the Windriders? The Windriders, I believe. I think I've heard of them. The tale said just a hundred of them could scatter a force of 20,000 men and capture three castles in one night. Yeah, they were a legendary band of mercenaries. It's no wonder Rollins itself was their primary employer. They sound crazy strong. Strong and loyal. To the point that even the Emperor of Rollins trusted them like his right-hand man. Isn't that right? It's true. Was true. But then, the Imperial family of Rollins ended up stabbing them in the back. Along with the very one I'm seeking vengeance against. The Imperial family joined forces with Hellions? Is it that surprising? I guess not. People and Hellions aren't separate entities, after all. Very true. You can even consider them two sides of the same coin. In fact, if the Cardinal's power is somehow linked to a Hellion, things start to make sense. It looks like Rose snuck out through the back. Can't take my eyes off her for a second. Hey, Dazzle! It's a good thing he can read the wind. I wonder if someone ordered an assassination. Who? And was she asked to do it by herself? Either way, this is bad. But first... Aw, oh, man. I wanted to go in here first. Alright, fine. Let's go check on her. Rose, are you okay? You're my main damage dealer, can you not? I guess I'm not really in any position to be complaining, but walking around all night on a rainy night like this really puts a chill in my heart, and in your armor. Rose. Don't be like this, Rose. Not like this. Rose? Rose? Okay, she's okay. You're okay! What's wrong? Why are you all here? That's what we want to know. Where were you going? Oh, just taking a walk. Thought maybe I ate too much. You don't have to follow every whim that pops into your head, damn it. We thought you might have ditched us to go assassinate someone. Not yet, silly. That comes later. Yeah? It's from someone who lost their son in the war that just broke out. Kill the one who started the battle. The invasion was proposed to the Emperor about a year ago, in documents bearing the name of Pope Misedra. Huh? You're gonna kill the Pope? Hold on. Pope. How do you know someone didn't just use his name? I thought he went missing after all. Maybe. But then again, maybe not. It's awfully close to the time he went missing. We'll have to investigate further. And what if we find out that he's bad? If it's evil? The scattered bones slay it. Even if it's the Pope? The Pope, the Emperor, even the Shepherd. Oh, was that inappropriate? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a fan of that last part, it's true. It isn't like we walk around all stabby stabby. We make sure what kind of person our target is first. Hmm. I think I understand you better, Rose. Do you now? Well, that's good. Impulsive. I'm starting to understand, too. Why she bears no malevolence, that is. Because she's as nuts as he is? Yep. Rose would certainly never tell a lie, that's for sure. She was always that way. It's in her blood. Wait, in her blood? Was the Pope the type of person who would just up and start a war? 
That's certainly not the impression of him we got from Sergei. He's the de facto leader of a powerful country. He's probably got more layers than you'd think. First of all, though, explain to me in her blood. Does that mean they know each other's parent? Tell me more about equipment fusion. Okay, since fusion rules apply only to skills in the same exact slot, there are only three types of combinations you need to remember. First rule, if they're both the same skill, then that's the skill you get after fusion. Simple enough. I'm guessing that same rule applies when both slots are empty. Yes, the second rule is, if the slot's empty on one item and filled on the other, you get the skill from the filled slot. Got it. So, the big question is, what happens when two different skills are in the same slot? That's right. In this last case, a new skill is born from the two old ones, but it's sealed off temporarily. <laughs> and the way to break the seal is... Oh, my! Is you gotta keep fighting and get uh, item proficiency. That's how you unlock it. I think that's what they were talking about. More steak, please. Water, bore my foe! Ice, expand and spread! Yes, it's getting more stable. You're working awfully hard. No, well, this is... Things were a lot more complicated than we thought, especially with the Roland's Empire. As if the confrontation between the Night Squad and the Church wasn't enough. There's the Scattered Bones Assassin's Guild and Dezel's Revenge. That's quite a lot to handle. And there are issues with the Cardinal and Dezel's Vengeance. We may run into strong Hellions. And we also need to take care of Rose. I trust her, but regardless, she's still human. There's always a risk of getting affected by malevolence. True. Just like with the Shepherd, or something more. Despite all that, they're both pretty carefree about the whole thing. I'm getting fed up with them. It's because you're with them, Miklio. I don't know about that. I'm the same way. I'm just doing this for myself. I may not look like it, but I'm more ambitious than you might think. Do you really mean that? Of course. Let's see, do we have one more? One more? No, of course not. Well, what's left is for us to do what? Meet with Sergei again, right? Oh, oh, we get to take a look around the shrine, the shrine church now. Okay, sure. Let's go. Let's go do that. Um, that's the shrine church. Don't get distracted. I uh, can't. Guess I can't go wrong with buying a map. Yep, we did that one. Okay. Let's go to the church. I think it was this way. Down here, right? Yeah, we're good. Let's go. Hello? Anybody home? Just want to say hi. I like that it's a, it's a dungeon uh, icon on it. Well, that was easier than we thought. This looks like an auditorium of sorts for the believers. Sure looks like a small crowd. Hmm. Let me just look at the corners real quick. Make sure there's no uh, items just hidden. Okay, I guess we're good. Let's go down the middle. Let's see. Da 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 da. Okay, wait. Okay, no items. Let's go. Can you tell me the names of the seraphim who hold the utmost power, known as the five lords? Um. Five lords. Musef. Oh, and Eumacia. Hyanawa and Almanac. Correct. Now, can you tell me the name of the last one? The Seraph who's worshipped here at the Shrine Church? Motelis! Motelis! <gasps> That's a name. That's right! 
Mao Tellus is the seraph who has given the entire Glenwood continent his blessing. The seraph worshipped at the shrine church is Mao Tellus? The five lords, huh? Big movers and shakers. I bet Mao Tellus would know something about how to stand against the Lord of Calamity. He's got to. Is he really all that? Mm -hmm. Well, he's the leader of the five lords after all. You must be Sore. Welcome to the Roland's Church headquarters. I heard you were to visit. Please, come on in. What? How do they know? Um, are you kids okay? You're not bad, are you? Please be good kids. It's more magnificent than I'd even imagined. The architecture definitely dates it to the height of the era of Asgard. Glad to see you're impressed, but don't let your guard down. I just hope they're not bad kids. So this is the shrine of Mount Tellus? Mount Tellus more. Okay, uh, there's an inner sanctum. Um, doesn't look like there's anything bad. There's a save point though. Ooh. Can I save first? Nope. It's cracked. This inscription concerns the trial of the shepherd and the spiritual powers he obtains upon clearing it. Could the spiritual powers be real? Bzz, 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 bzz. Be real, real bees. Oh, bees everywhere. Just That's a yes. That's a yes. It's like the lettering's meant to tell us something. But it's all gibberish. It must be some kind of code. Well, it does involve sensitive info. Maybe there's a hint to crack the code somewhere. Hey, what does the big rock thing say? I'm afraid I'm not really sure. The inscription is written in some sort of cipher, and the key to interpreting it is handed down only from Pope to Pope. So, I guess we'll have to get the Pope to read it then, huh? Um. Uh-oh. Sir We're in the domain. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. I don't feel so good. What is going on? It's a Hellion's domain. Just like when we fought Helldolf. Oh, I can't go back there. Please don't let the kids be dead. Or evil. Somebody's out there. They're alive, but... It's like they've been turned to stone. Alright, alright, fine. Let's go. She looks evil. You can tell it's a she because of the shape. There's no way that's a male model. Definitely not Zoolander. Going home already, Shepard? Yes. <gasps> I am Cardinal Fortin of the Church of Rollins. This domain, is it yours? Ah, so you can still move. Why don't you lend me your powers? For the sake of the people, of course. Hmm. They asked me the same thing in Highland. I hardly think myself the equal of a Philistine like Bartlow. Sounds like something a Philistine would say. <laughs> Charming, but sticks and stones and so on, young lady. Ooh, she's good. I have but one wish. To see my empire overcome this tumultuous era of chaos. A task only possible if the people are united. Okay. But Rollins is far too expansive to unify the people through mere patriotism alone. Shepard, do you know exactly what it is that the state has used for eons to keep an entire country in line? Food. Is it... faith? 
Yes, faith. <laughs> it is the belief in their own salvation that inspires in people the greatest sense of unity when they band together against outsiders who share different values. Meaning that my church itself should serve as the cornerstone for all of Roland's. Maybe in your mind. It is but the vision of one who would guide the people. With the name and power of the Shepherd, more people than ever can be brought to salvation. Then you should cooperate with the Knights. Wouldn't that really be what's best for everyone? I would welcome their efforts if they would simply bend to my will and do as I command. Even if they are a pack of loutish meatheads who can't figure out that their Pope abandoned them. Hmm? Wait a minute, the Pope just ran away? You didn't have him locked up? I am not a street thug, child. The Pope, Macedra, I should say, left of his own accord. Abandoning his duty to both the Empire and his followers. What, pray tell, would you call such a man? Pretty irresponsible, if what you're saying is true. Irresponsible is one word, and still there are so many fools out there who trust in such a coward. The Knights, for example. In order to bring the people together, we must find Macedra and give him his due punishment. Punishment? Yes, the same punishment that befell those uncivil enough to mistrust me. Then we have a problem. We need the Pope to tell us the meaning of the inscription. Why? Cooperate with me and it won't be necessary. I need to know. No matter what. Ah, I see. That's very unfortunate. So then you mean to say... What the... My body! That you reject my vision! Saray! <sighs> Let's go! We're leaving. How are they this strong? Or she is not that strong. She's not as strong as Heldolf. What? They broke through my domain and connected with the Seraphim, if only just for a moment. Oh, will I relish this. She's not wrong. It's just that she doesn't have faith. Oh, okay. Okay. They disappeared? What the hell was that? It's called the Spectral Cloak. <laughs> You've been practicing in secret, haven't you? That was sweet. We'll talk later. We've got to flee to the Knight's Tower. Also, you can't run with this on. Knight's Tower. Which one was it? Over there. Ooh, I'll take that. How did I miss that the first time? So, now we know, well, could we trust her though? I think we could trust what she said about the Pope. Mostly because there's no reason for her to lie. She's already revealed that she has a domain, she's a Hellion, I mean, well I don't know if she's a Hellion, but she definitely has a domain. So there's no reason for her to lie about the Pope. The Pope maybe just ran. Maybe the Pope was a fraud to begin with. Got a dash. You go on ahead. Oh, it's a gill. Uh, okay. The Pope fled of his own volition? I'm sorry I couldn't get more details. We were sort of running for our lives. No, that is more than enough. I'm just relieved that you weren't captured. 
Thanks for saving us back there. It's the least I could do. Seraph Miklio, my humble admiration for your bravery. It's nothing, really. You can't see it. It is nothing. All you did was blind her temporarily. We have to do something about her domain. Those powers might help. Let's get the Pope to decipher that inscription. That'll be tough if we don't know where he is. The Knights have been hunting him for a year now with no success. Yeah, but they were assuming the whole time that the Cardinal was behind the disappearance. Guess what? I think I know where Popadope might be. Oh. You do? The village of Gadadin on the southern part of the continent. We won't know for sure until we check it out, of course. How did you get that information? Well, let's just call it an industry secret. You know how it is. <laughs> of course. I should have expected no less from the wife of the shepherd. <laughs> Let us send a search team to Gadadin. Don't. Hold on a minute. The Cardinal already expects that our side will be searching for the Pope. A highly visible squadron of knights would essentially be a bright pink arrow pointed straight at him. However, we can operate covertly in small numbers. Let us handle Gadadin. But that's far too much to ask. Chill, Captain. We got this. What is it they say? Pope springs eternal? Pope. Abandon Pope! All ye who uh, don't <laughs> go to Gadadin. Okay, settle down. <laughs> My thanks, gentle shepherd. Actually, as for what you can do in return, do you suppose we could get a pass to Rollins? I might be mistaken for an ally of the Highland Army otherwise. I have seen for myself the quality of your character. I shall prepare it immediately. Nice. Thank you. That's a load off my mind. There is something I would like to impart to you as well. Would you please step outside for a moment? Okay. But before that, talk to Rose. Sure know how to gather intel, Rose. Comes with the job. Information is power, as far as I say. Something to impart? What does that mean? Well, it's Sergei we're talking about, so whatever it is, you can bet he's serious about it. Better go see what's up. What, don't you think? I do. I'm terribly sorry, but I can't allow you to pass beyond this point. I hope this doesn't seem like I'm overstepping my any boundaries, but please, you must find Pope Macedra for us. Gadadin. Ugh. Further south of any village in the land. It takes a few days to get there and back. I pray that in your travels, you will be able to confirm the safety of Boris and the others. I do want to say Boris though, come on. The idea that Pope Macedra fled of his own accord might not be entirely untrue. His family passed away several years ago, and since then, he was wont he was wont he was wont to look forlorn. Sure. Whatever the whereabouts of the Pope, we shall stand beside the captain. Anyone who does not is blind to the captain's qualities as cap as n <laughs> anyone who does not is blind to the captain's qualities as a knight of the Empire. Ooh, what is that? Our nation's eyes are upon us. And we must stand together for the people. Alright, let's go back over here to Heldolf. What's up, buddy? Oh, Heldolf. Please. Portrait of Heldolf. So this is the true face of the Lord of Calamity? For real? I don't know. He just looked like a big lion-headed hellion to us. But Lila said that the Earth and Historia would be the guidepost to lead us to the Lord of Calamity. And the human mentioned there was held off. It would make sense that they're one and the same. Huh. Yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Makes him look like a pretty distinguished gentleman, actually. Yeah. He looks maybe the same age as our dads, don't you think? Or at least, that's how old he was 20-ish years ago. Looks like he was the first captain of the knights. To hang his portrait like this. He must command a lot of respect from Sergei and the rest of the knights. Sarei? I'm okay. It just sank in for me. The Lord of Calamity isn't some faceless monster. 
He's a human being. Just like me. <laughs> <laughs> just happens to be corrupted by malevolence. Let's go outside. What does Sergei want? Do you remember the art I used when we fought against one another? That is the Lion's Howl, an art passed down through our band of knights. I and my younger brother Boris are the only ones alive who know it. But now I pass it to you as well. Wilt thou accept? Yes. Teach me. Okay, fine. So set it up. Lion's Howl. Lion's Howl! Howl. Well, you're a fast learner. I must apologize that this feeble art is all an oaf like me may offer you. Basically, the whole tutorial was you hitting me with it, and then you said, Good job, you learned it. Don't say that. It's incredible. Thank you so much, Captain Sergei. You and I stand as equals. You may call me Sergei. Then you may call me Sarei. Sarei, I am loath to believe the Pope just abandoned his post on us. But I also sense that there may be another side to this unfortunate story. I understand. We'll find the Pope and come back with the truth. Godspeed. So far, the theme has been... Not every story is black and white. There's always a gray area. Rose. Was it the Scattered Bones who found the information on the Pope? Maybe. Seeing where the church's money was going gave us a little hint. That's what I thought. You guys sure don't operate in the same way that the Knights do. Of Course not! An Assassin's Guild can't function without proper intel. Assassins, right. Here is your pass, Sore. Thank you. Our travel should be much easier now. I wish it were so, but we've received word that Byroclef Ridge, which leads to Gadotten, has been blocked by rock slides. We could have been on the ridge right now. If only we'd been a little bolder. Wow. Rose! My punchline! Wow. What's the plan? You'll have to go through Cambria Caverns, south of the Meadow of Triumph. An underground passage, huh? No problem! <laughs> That's your thing, isn't it? You bet it is! Okay. Underground passage just tells me that maybe we're closer to getting the, uh, the Lord of the Land for Last in Bell. We shall rein in the Cardinal as best as we can. I pray that you all remain safe from harm. Thank you. Um, so south. Let's, let's look for a lake in Cambria Caverns. Don't know if that's where the missing Seraph busted off to, but I'm guessing the knights are gone by now. So it might be worth exploring either way. I'll remind you that it is a cave, though. Be careful. Careful we don't get lost. Um, anything else? No, that's about it. Let's get out of this place. We do have to hit... Is it this way? Yeah. We have to hit the inn first, though. Anybody got something new to say? Talk to me! Yeah, right now, they're bas they basically have a famine going on. Let's see, any new items? Of course not, I just kind of bought everything you had. To the end! And then we go watch some skits, the Cardinal and the Pope. Sure looks like the Cardinal's a Hellion. 
Indeed. Though we have yet to discover its true form. In other words, she claims to be serving the people, but in reality, she's just furthering her own ambitions. Sounds about right, stupid humans. Perhaps she was burdened with a responsibility she could not bear. The pressure to do something, anything, most likely was channeled into her sense of self-justification. So basically she couldn't hack it. Do you think the Pope jumping ship might have been what finally set her off? That I couldn't tell you. Your, uh, job kind of depends on that, right? Yep. That's why I gotta track down this Pope and see for myself just what kind of person he is. <sighs> Saray, you must gain the spiritual powers. Everything else comes second. Right. Let's try and find the Pope. Go, go, Gadadin! It really does seem like that um, the Cardinal was pushed into this spot where people betrayed her and she had to take on a role that maybe was a little above her. She needed power and kind of just relied on the Hellion's power. And this way she will have full control where no one can betray her and just every expectation would be exactly as she planned. Maybe, I don't know, but that's what I'm getting at because the Pope left, just up and left. And she's trying to scramble and, you know, unify the people through faith, but it turns more into fear. <sighs> I ate too much today. My stomach's all achy. Oh my, you shouldn't stuff yourself like that, Rose. By the way, I was curious. Can Seraphim get upset stomachs or gain weight? To say it in a fairy tale sort of way, your thoughts become reality. What's that supposed to mean? We won't gain weight from consuming calories, but we will from thinking, I'll gain weight if I eat this much. Whoa! So does that mean you'll be okay as long as you don't think like that? No. Denying the reality of things leads to malevolence. A seraph must not be detached from reality. So at the end of it all, you could say we're the same as humans. This is so confusing! Just start with that. Start that you're the same as humans. I'm gonna eat some steak. And then we leave this place, we save, and then we're done. Okay, let's go. Time to get out of uh, Pendrago. Pendrago? Pendrago. Ooh. I see someone up there. A Hellion! Is it one of the Cardinal's guards? Yeah. Basically. Saray, we have to trick the guard into thinking we're not here somehow. Yep, I got it. Ready and oh, I got too close. Would it kill you to use that head of yours? Sheesh. Give me a break. I'm trying to get as close as I can. You don't learn, do you? I do! I swear, it's right here. Let's go. Don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop. Get me out of here. Got it. We made it. Think we lost the cardinal with that? I sure hope so. Is that it? Alright, do we save here? Yeah, we save here. I got other things to do today. So, that is the end of our travels for two no maybe not today maybe i'll do one more but for right now so just want to thank everybody that stopped by a lot of things got done sort of but the crucible was probably the biggest one because mcleo's crucible is a pain in the ass that and i don't know how to control these characters i actually don't know how to play this game i just know the story so um i'll see you guys next time let's get to the end screen and uh, yeah, maybe I'll play some D DBD now. Later.